Hey guys, I'm Arsim from RossmerTech.com and in this tutorial I'll be talking about optional parameters. Now what are optional parameters? Well, optional parameters can either be named or positional, but they cannot be both. Both of them can have values, but if a value is not given, then the value is null. Now let me show you guys an example of both types here. Let's start off with optional name parameters. This is how we specify an optional name parameter. We use the par parameter name ending with a colon, then a space, then we give it a value. As you can see here, this is the parameter name here with a colon, bold, then we hit space, and this is the value, which is true. You could have more than one parameter. We s separate parameters with this comma here, then we hit space, now this is the second parameter name here, which is hidden, hidden and now uh, it's ending with a colon here, then we hit space and we give it a value. Now let's talk about optional positional parameters. It's basically very simple. You rewrap these uh, brackets around a functional parameter to make it an optional positional parameter. Here's an example of that right now. This here, we wrapped uh, the string device in a bracket and that made it an optional positional parameter. So that's pretty much it. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if it was helpful, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rasim from RossmerTech.com and thanks for watching.